Our objectives of this morning was to promote vocational service, um, to encourage pride in all other vocations, to provide employers with an opportunity to recognise employees who display excellence in workplaces, to encourage employer-employee relationships and a sense of community pride in individual achievement, to provide an opportunity for Rotary to be involved in communities, particularly in the business community, um, and also to provide a window of Rotary clubs for anyone interested in membership. Um, through, this, through this program, we endeavour to create a national attitude um, for the belief of our country, do it once, do it well, build a better Australia. Um, we now take great pleasure in introducing our awardees for 2011. Um, we start off. I'd now like to invite um, our president Sue and also Kenton to come up to um, pre like present our awardees with their awards. Um, so the Pride of Workmanship Awards for uh, 2011 is uh, Marius Juashkovich of Bank of Queensland, Oxenford. Um, Marius is employed as a mobile home lending manager and was nominated by his bank manager, Hanley Jones. <laughs> Marius prides himself as a can-do man. His passion for helping others achieve their housing dreams is unrivaled. He is a driven achiever and sees himself as a 24-7 banker. Congratulations. Sophie Wilson of Lynx Hope Island. Sophie is an attendant of the Lynx Bar and Restaurant. She was nominated by Lynx General Manager Mark Holland. <laughs> Sophie has shown great passion and a, a very positive attitude. She is friendly and goes that extra mile to ensure all members and guests are treated well. She is well liked by fellow staff, members and guests. Congratulations. <laughs> Jessica Copson of Simon's Lover Coffee, Oxenford. Jessica is the manager at the coffee shop and was nominated by her owner, Simon Zoo. Miss Jessica Copson is such a wonderful staff to be working with. She's passionate, professional, and always puts 120% of herself into hard working. We're really grateful to have her to be part of our team, and we would love to say thank you very much, Jess. Love you. Thank you. Tanya Kubra of Hope Island Medical Centre, Hope Island. Tanya is the practice nurse at the centre and was nominated by the practice principal and director, Dr. Andrew Weissenberger. <laughs> Tanya displays pride in her work every single day and as our senior practice nurse drives clinical quality improvements. She is a strong advocate for our patients and their health and well-being and supports and guides our patients to achieve their health goals. She inspires us on a daily basis and truly deserves our pride of workmanship recognition. We have also got um, Carol Wallam of Oxenford and Calchem Pro Chemists, that's our pharmacy. Um, as owners of the pharmacy, we nominated Carol for this award. Um, she has been in our business uh, for nearly four years and is a a definite asset to our business. Um, Carol, <laughs> Carol consistently shows a passion and dedication to her work and to our business as a whole. Um, her extensive knowledge, experience and genuineness ensure our customers receive exceptional care. She is a strong advocate for the our award theme, do it once, do it well. Carol is an asset not only to our pharmacy but also to our pharmacy industry as a whole. Congratulations. <laughs> Unfortunately, some of our awardees um, from the Black Angus Bar and Grill have not made it here this morning, but we'll recognise them anyway. Um, Martin McMullen of Black Angus Bar and Grill Sanctuary Cove, 
Um, Martin is a waiter there and in, in the restaurant and was nominated by his manager and owner, John Manhagoff. Um, Martin displays excellence on service and beyond. He is always friendly and attentive and a very valued team member at Black Angus and a valued member of the Sanctuary Cove community. <clears throat> And that concludes our Pride of Workmanship Awards. Cool. Thank you very much. <laughs>